I noticed that everyone has hands free and eyes on me. Oh, almost everyone. Transitions should be clear for every student. Purposeful, respectful, efficient. That was easy. And thanks for your work over the last 25 minutes of class. I just wanted to check in and see if you had any kind of like technology questions that maybe popped up as you started this work on your graph. Transitions during lessons work best when they are planned by the teacher ahead of time to move the lesson forward smoothly. Up on the board, our last protocol for today. There are five posters around the room now. When I write lesson plans, I write what it is I'm gonna say and what it is I'm gonna do during a transition. So if I don't plan transitions before doing them, I might not do them in the most effective way. Directions should be given in small bites. Materials should be easy to access. In your own seat sack, you'll find a little surprise from me. I disseminated the materials this morning prior to the lesson. My students have seat sacks behind their chairs, so I had tucked away the materials that I had differentiated for them. Transitions can be practiced regularly by students, rehearsed and critiqued by the class until they are sharp. Let's try one more time because I want everyone's beautiful eyes on me. And... Now I see everyone's hands are free and eyes are on me. Much better. It's time to clean up 